hello okay so we begin our discussion on trigonometric functions of angles by okay considering an angle okay, in standard position I okay, suppose this is our partition plane the x-axis and the y-axis so we say based from our previous discussion that an angle is in standard position if okay our initial side is on the positive x-axis and our terminal side is somewhere else rotated okay so we form an angle an angle theta in this case okay. and then suppose okay this angle in standard position the terminal side intersects a point okay we call the point point P okay, so point P with coordinates X and then Y okay so we can actually create a triangle here with sides x and y okay and then we call the hypotenuse r the relationship between the three variables are i mean the relationship can be uh, solved using the pythagorean theorem okay so r squared is equal to x squared plus y squared okay so we can actually solve for r which is equal to the square root of x squared plus y squared okay so based from the values of x y and r we can solve for the six trigonometric ratios okay we say sine of theta is equal to the y coordinate divided by the hypotenuse the cosine of theta is equal to x divided by r tangent of theta equals y over x and then cosecant of theta is equal to r over y second of theta is r over x and cotangent of theta is x over y okay so these are the six trigonometric ratios based from the values of x y and r we can actually see based from uh, the values I mean the formula that sine of theta and cosecant of theta are reciprocals of each other okay since sine of theta is y over r cosecant of theta is r over y so they are reciprocal same is true with cosine theta and second theta also with tangent of theta and cotangent of theta okay so we will illustrate these uh, formulas in the next example